Hello there, this is Dev Cloud and DevOps Ask Me Anything. On this series, I've been answering questions on DevOps, Dev Cloud, and things that relate with these technologies. And I got a question that came in from a lovely fellow, and the question goes thus. I have been learning to code for a while now, and I've got my hands on some basic languages like JavaScript, Latin PHP, and already have in-depth knowledge of HTML and CSS, including some frameworks. Although, still learning on my own, Please, how can I get to look at developer communities on social media that I can follow and enhance my development? First, I want to say to you, kudos. You've done quite well learning all this by yourself. And you know, as they say, uh, no one is an island of knowledge. So uh, I, I really want to say good work. You've really learned your stuff. Um, and to your question of locating developer communities, I'll get to that. Uh, but the first thing I want to say to you is, um, the fact that you've learned many languages, the first thing you want to do is build projects. Uh, there are many project ideas online. If you just go on your favorite search engine, Google, Bing, DuckDuckGo, it all depends on you. Uh, just search for beginner projects in web development. Look for these projects and try to apply whatever language you've learned, CSS, PHP, HTML, whatever framework, React, Vue, Angular, whatever it is, apply them to those basic projects and try to improve your skill that way and now to answer your question finding a developer community to actually join on social media that is a good way to go because the community essentially helps us grow they help us share knowledge and help us solve our problems from time to time and also helps us be able to actually reach out to others to be able to impact that sort of knowledge so for me the first place i'll advise you go to check out is actually meetup.com meetup.com that's m-e-e-t-u-p.com that is the place where you find meetups in your local area uh whatever location you're in in the world nigeria ghana uk us india china meetup.com is one of the top places you want to be at just put in your location put in your email address if you don't have an account already sign up and then put your location and put your preferences and then communities around you be suggested to you when they have having meetups they have mobile apps also for android and ios so you're always on the go also with it so if you go to meetup.com <coughs> excuse me you would be able to find these communities to join and be a part of a volunteer to speak also it helps you build some sort of confidence level in yourself to be able to solve problems so answer questions ask questions join those communities and also one place you also want to be well is twitter yeah most of the people who develop the languages and frameworks we use these days actually live on twitter to be able to answer our questions to be able to just offer some advice you see threads on you know being a developer being a devops engineer being etc everyone is out there follow the people you want to be like so that their contacts people like them get suggested to you and then even when they have events or meetups coming up they will be able to tweet it and then you will see it be able to attend and that way you can grow your community and enhance your development from there so for me i'm not trying to advertise meetup.com i'm not trying to advertise twitter but if i was starting out in my career and i wanted information those are the two top places i would go i don't want to mess up your head with too many links and stuff so i'll say meetup.com and twitter would be your top choices of places so if you get up if you go to meetup.com and you sign up put your location and your preferences of languages and frameworks these communities will get suggested to you automatically and you can decide to join as many as possible uh you know some meetups will be online some will be offline some would be a uh, hybrid it all depends on your preferences you decide which ones to attend you know attend these conferences attend these meetups attend these events to be able to foster your knowledge from time to time so that is one of the ways to grow community i say kudos to you once again for learning all these languages on your own it is really not easy i can tell you that for sure so kudos to you and all the best in your universe and i hope that answer your question and if you have further questions, remember to drop them in the comment section. I'll put the link to ask further questions in the link showing on your screen right now. And also, I'll put it as a pinned comment and also in the video description. So you can always ask questions and I'll try to get to answer them as soon as possible. Also, if you like this video so far, like and share with your friends and family and whoever you think might gain from this video. It helps the channel and it also helps this video reach people who actually need it. Until I come your way again with yet another video, remember to stay safe and goodbye.